Hey, what's going on YouTube? It's Kevin. Tomorrow I am starting my eight week weight loss documentary. I have been hinting about this on Twitter for the past two weeks. And the hint about it was that I was starting another journey. It still was the same journey, but it was a 60 day journey. But let me tell y'all about this story. Let me tell y'all what happened. So over the summer, I seen P90X commercials and I seen Insanity DVD commercials. I said, hmm, I don't want to commit myself to 90 days like the P90X, but I know I could commit myself to 60 days. Long story short, I ordered the Insanity DVDs. And the DVD came, and I sat it to the side and said, when I come home from the Dominican Republic, I will work out on these DVDs. I mean, I will work out on this schedule. And... You know, I opened the box, I put my uh, my workout calendar on the wall, I had the nutrition plan, you know, I looked through it to see, you know, what stuff I can eat or, you know, which will help me during this 60-day um, program, so, and I sat it to the side. My niece moved, I know I brought the box upstairs, or at least I thought I brought the box upstairs with all the DVDs and stuff in them, and I cannot find them. I done looked all over the house for this box and I can't find the DVDs. So I'm like, Amber, are the, are the DVDs at your house? And she's like, no. So I'm thinking that somewhere in between this move, the box got thrown away with some all these magazines. You know, my niece had all kinds of fucking magazines everywhere. I know y'all seen me do the video cursing her out about the magazines. So I'm thinking maybe my niece's store, there was a box with magazines, so they threw it out. I don't know, but I can't find it. But, you know, I said, you know what? Just because I can't find it does not mean that I still can't work out because I have video games designed to help me to lose weight on the Connect. And I still am upset, though, because that's $150 that I done lost on this buying that, and I can't do anything. So what I want you guys to do is <clears throat> I want you to pick which Connect game I should choose to do my eight-week uh, weight loss journey on. Now I have the Biggest Loser Ultimate Workout and I have Your Shape Fitness Evolved. Both of these are very good uh, video games. I've used both of them. Both of them had me aching but I want you guys to pick which one should I choose and I'm not going to say anything else about the games. I want you guys to pick them so you can leave it down in the comments below. Um, so for my recreational time to help me lose weight in the house, besides walking and all of that good stuff outside, I have my favorite, Dance Central, which has about maybe 60 songs so far, and a new game comes out October 25th, which I will be buying Dance Central 2, and Michael Jackson, The Experience. So both of these games will be my recreational time for when I want to lose weight. Like after I finish a video with Mikkel while the video was editing, I will spend time right here in this room working out to uh, these songs and dancing. And these songs get you sweating. A lot of people don't know that, but your ass be sweating. If you have either one of these games, you know that you sweat. Especially, not just especially this one, Dance Central with the workout, break it down mode, all of that. Definitely get you sweating. This one, Michael Jackson, I haven't really taken a lot of time to like learn all the routines. I just love the simplicity of Dance Central, but both of them give you a workout. <clears throat> get you sweating, excuse me. But yeah, you guys, I have been wanting to do this for a while, a long time. And over the summer, you know, I really wanted to do it, but I'm like, it's not going to work because I party too much with my friends and that leads to drinking. And when you drink, you know, you want to start eating, especially at night. So, you know, after partying and clubbing, you know, we go to the restaurants and I would just eat wings and burgers, fries. Y'all know how I get down. I love food. That's something I just can't, you know, I just do love food. But who doesn't love food is my body. You know, it make me look pregnant. Look, y'all, I look pregnant from the side. This, I can't take. I can't take that. And pictures, I don't like it, you know. And over the summer, I've gained 15 pounds. So I went from 215 to 230. And I'm going to weigh myself before I start this journey. You guys will see all of that tomorrow. 
I know right now it says 2.30. It could say something else, but since I've been home, I've been drinking a lot, a lot of water. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of water. And I've been eating tuna. I haven't been eating heavy at all. So I know I probably, that when I weigh myself on Saturday, I know I probably weigh a little bit less. But I have been doing really, really good. Um, I am just excited to do this because my birthday is coming up, you know, and that's in like nine weeks, nine or ten weeks. Whatever, whatever the case. So I'm having a big birthday party and I would love to be in shape for my birthday party. And, you know, I want to look good. I know I look good regardless, but the extra pounds in my stomach, I don't like. I don't like, I just don't like it. It's not a good thing. And if you don't like something, you have to change it. And this, I don't like. Now, I've been, I know y'all heard me say before, oh, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Then I was like, fuck it. No. This time, I am so serious. I am really, really serious. I am just committed to this. I got the rug on the floor. I got the connect up here. I got the games. I, I'm just so ready to do this because mentally I'm like, I've got to get this shit off of me. I got to get some of this off of me. Not all of it. I don't want to be no goddamn toothpick now. I want to look good, but I just want some of this weight off of me, especially here. And, you know, the, the, the weirdest thing is sometimes, I, I'm not sometimes, I do not like to hear, if you meet me, please don't tell me you look so much smaller in person. I don't like that because it makes me think that when you look at me through the computer screen, I'm this real big guy and I don't like people, like sometimes when people leave comments, they be like, oh, well, you lost a lot of weight. And they'll be like, I ain't lose a goddamn thing. I've actually gained weight. So I don't understand those comments. I don't know if people being nice or whatever. But anyway, <clears throat> over the next two months, you'll see me, pro you'll see me, not probably, you will see me slim down. And another thing is like when I be watching those uh, Best of Scorpion Show videos, it, it kills me that I be, I be looking good, like my weight is fine, and then I look big. I look small, and I look big. I be like, oh my God, I really need to get this shit together. So I am so serious, you guys. I done told my friends I will not be seeing them during these next two months, but I will see Brandon for his birthday. We're going to hang out. We're gonna, I am going to drink that night, and I will drink when I go to D.C. the first weekend in November for my, um, one of my best friend's wedding. So I am going to do, I know that those two days I'm going, they're going to be bad. Well, that weekend is going to be bad in November, and that um, for Brandon's birthday are going to be bad. But other than that, I have excluded drinking. No drinking alcohol. I won't be drinking alcohol. You won't see me drunk on blog TV. You won't see me drunk doing any uh, award show reviews. I will be 100% sober. And I'm hoping that I have a lot of energy when I do my videos. You know, another thing is I have been trying to do my blog. I have been so damn lazy. I just started today doing my blog. I have a lot of shit to do, you guys. I have to wash my winter clothes. And I have so much to do. Not little time, but I do have a whole lot to do. And I want to get all of that shit out the way and stop being so lazy. So when I kept telling you guys I'm trying to find the balance, I'm trying to find that balance in my life. Right now, everything is balanced out. I, have, I am in control of everything, and I hate not being in control. And I know, like, I might sound like I'm rambling, but you guys, I am so serious. If you could put a Bible in front of my face, I will put my right hand on the Bible and swear. So, I am definitely committed to this. Uh, I don't know if you want to, if you guys, do you guys want me to document the journey? I'm going to document the journey, but do you want to see weekly videos of my progress, or do you want to see it when it's over? I'm going to tell you, I think I should do it weekly. I'm just, I think I should do it weekly so that way y'all can see that I'm serious. But you guys, you let me know. Let me know about that too. I'm rambling on. I'm rambling on. Yes, I know. But um, look for a new video tonight with Mikel and myself. And I will talk to y'all later. Peace.